Data is the new oil. But why is that? Every time you turn on your phone, visit any website, watch any video, notification comes on your screen, how many times you clicked on it, which types of video you watch, whom do you follow, which places you visit, everything is tracked when you are connected to the internet to understand how you behave online. Whenever you see any ad on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, these all ads are personalized for you. So if you compare your ad experience to some other person, it will be completely different. Your online experience will be completely different from your sister, mother, father, even your friends you will only see those things which you like and which you are most interested in and companies will only target you based on that ads are just one example how companies such as facebook and google uses their data but there are different many companies that uses their data to improve their day-to-day -day life cycle such as in the case of amazon they want to understand what customers are buying they want to understand which customers are more loyal and which customers are not buying frequently enough so they can collect all of these data and understand customer behavior and take decisions based on that which products to improve which customers to target and many more things now this data gets generated in many different things text images videos music and many more some of the data are structured and some of the data are unstructured such as images text sometimes customers writes review on amazon and they don't write properly so these data are called as unstructured data now these data are stored in large data center built by different companies and you can use their computation power to process this data to build a system that can pull value from these data and to do all of these jobs companies need people People who understand the system and can perform different activities such as data analysts, data engineers, machine learning engineers, data scientists, BI analysts and many more. And when there is a huge demand and less supply then the salary of these people also increases. So in this video I want to mainly focus on different roles such as data analysts, data engineers, data scientists, machine learning engineers, how much they earn, what are the skills needed and what they do in day to day basis. Now before we understand how much these people earn it is also important to understand that everything is depend on your skill set level, how much experience you have and how much value you can create for that particular company for example let's say you have 10 years of experience in it industry but if you don't have the skill set required by the company and you can't provide the value to the company then company will not pay you compared to the person who let's say have the five years of experience but also has the latest skills required for the company and create huge amount of value so your salary is mainly dependent on your skill set level and how much value you can provide to a company so let's get started with the video first we have data analyst what does a data analyst actually do these are the people who mainly work on analyzing data, building reports, metrics using excel or any visualization tool it also depends on the company you are working in if you are a fresher and if you just graduated then this is the general position you will get in the data industry if you are a fresher or just graduated from the college then average salary paid for this role in any service-based company is around 4 lakh to 5 lakh per annum as you get more experience and understanding of the industry then you can easily scale your salary to 7 lakh to 14 lakhs again it depends on your skill set level but if you are good enough with your skills then you can easily get 100 to 200 percent hike in just one to two years so what are the skills needed for data analyst you just need to understand the basics of coding so you can just learn one particular language if you don't know any language then you can learn python you should also know how to work with the databases so you should know sql because sql is the way you communicate with the database you also need to learn about some of the visualization tools such as power bi tableau if you know one visualization tool then you are good enough you also need to know excel because most of the companies uses excel in day-to-day -day job then you also have to clear your basic mathematics fundamentals such as how to take mean median mode and some of the basic statistics fundamental that are required for daily computation with the data and the reason for this is that you will be working with a lot of different data and crunching the numbers so you should know all of these skills on the first place now as you grow more in your career then you will become a manager or senior data analyst then you can easily scale your salary up to 30 to 40 lakhs per annum and it takes around like three to four years if you are good enough to become a manager in one particular company so the fundamental is simple the more responsibility and accountability you take the more money will company pay to you now after data analyst we have data engineers so what does a data engineer do these people have skill set of data analysts but they also work on the other things such as creating data pipelines writing etl jobs building data warehouses and managing different things as a fresher data engineer you can easily get between six to nine lakhs per annum i started my career with seven lakhs per annum as a fresher in data engineering domain earlier companies used to only hire experienced people for data engineering roles, but now they also started hiring fresher so if you are a fresher then you can easily get into data engineering as you grow in your data engineering career and learn more about different roles 
roles and different technologies then you can easily scale your salary from 14 to 20 lakhs i know a lot of my friends who started their career in service based company and used to earn 3 lakh per annum but now after 2 to 3 years they are able to scale their salary and now earning between 14 to 20 lakh per annum so what are the skills required for data engineers now if you have been following me from the start then you know i'm a data engineer and i talk a lot of things about data engineering so for a data engineer you should know one programming language it can be python java or scala once you learn programming language then you also need to learn structured query language which is sql this is most important skills to have as a data engineer then once you learn sql then you can learn about big data fundamentals how databases are built learning about olap versus oltp and more fundamental concept then you can learn about some of the data warehouses technologies dashboarding tools and many more now i have the complete roadmap on data engineering and if you want to become a data engineer then you can check my complete roadmap series over here and you will gain more knowledge now you can watch that particular video after watching this video now let's talk about our third role which is data scientist so what does a data scientist do data scientist does various things but mainly they work on analytical side just like data analyst but they also work on machine learning areas such as forecasting building recommendation system time series analytics and many more starting pay for this role starts from 7 lakh per annum to 12 lakh per annum after having few years of experience and knowledge you can easily reach 16 to 20 lakhs per annum skills required for data scientists are same as data analysts so you need to learn about one programming language also understand sql excel and basics of analytics but as a data scientist you will also need to understand more of a mathematical concepts such as linear algebra more advanced statistics concept because you will be working with a lot of machine learning algorithm working on forecasting time series analysis and many more different things now in this particular video we are mainly focusing on salaries of different rules but if you want me to create a detailed roadmap for data scientists then let me know in the comments i will make that for you and last on the list we have machine learning engineers so what does a machine learning engineer do machine learning or ai engineers are people who mainly work on training testing validating and deploying machine learning models on production a data engineer will collect data and make it into more structured format and build a data warehouse around it data scientist person will come and work on those data do a feature engineering so that machine learning model can be built on top of it and analyze the data then the machine learning engineer will come and use that data to build a machine learning model on large scale so that it can be used in production starting pay for machine learning engineers are between 7 lakh per annum to 12 lakh per annum if you have the right skill and knowledge then you can easily get a good company and earn this amount as you grow in your career then you can earn up to 18 to 20 lakh per annum even more than that again it depends on the work you do skills you have and the company you are working in i will put down all the sources for these salaries and all the data in the description so you can check it out and learn more about it now if you want to know more about these salaries and all the sources that are used then you can check the link in the description and learn more about it and as always thank you for watching this video if you learn something new then make sure you hit the like button and if you are new here, then hit the subscribe button that will help my channel to grow and reach more and more people. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.